fortunate enough to be hired to do voiceover work for the Tom Joyner Morning Show, courtesy of comedy veteran and radio legend Brad Sanders. Today's his birthday. You might remember him as Batty Boy from Hollywood Shuffle back in the day. Well, he records radio bits at a voiceover studio where big time TV and film projects get made. It's actually a pretty amazing place to go to and work. On the first page, did you see where it says takes a gulp of our drink? Uh huh. Can you get some big gulps down there? Uh, or a little ah at the end or something like that. Uh, there you go. Uh, that's, <laughs> what that's what you want? Okay. For obvious reasons, Roxanne is one of the funniest voice actors I've ever worked with. I tell the T R U C H, and don't you ever forget it. Ain't none of y'all happy to see me. Maybe you should slow that down, eh, Mabel? Damn. That's the same thing I tried to tell your daddy before he married your mom. That woman is a freak. And he talked and talked and tried to tell me how she wasn't. He didn't think that when he caught him messing with his cousin Daryl. What? Boy, didn't you know? Daryl is your real daddy. You still on the burp. (laughs) (laughs) That probably was the realest burp I ever heard in my life. wonderful family reunion moment has been brought to you by the Tom Jorner Morning Show, who reminds you that everyone has an Aunt Mabel. Now Brad is definitely a perfectionist. I gotta say it again. Brad, say it again how you look. Aunt Mabel, man. I can remember when Brad wrote my first check. He said, I'm not paying you this because I think this is what you're worth. I'm paying you this because I respect you. And that meant a lot to me. Brad employs a lot of black actors and actresses in Hollywood and keeps money in their pocket. A couple cats I like the whole you know church with is King Kedar and Brandon Bowler. They don't coming in, they're all too old, they don't have no flavor, plus your stage presence allows you to bring in a lot of the different elements that you work with. That's what's needed. You know, when you look at this business, there are cats that are, that are real good in this behind the scenes stuff. They get over there, they're not as talented as other people. There's other people that get over there that are just talented and they, they ain't got no skills in the behind the scenes. And it's a shame. Well, black men always got to be both. I'm both. Yeah. You got to be I prefer to take the time to come out when I'm supposed to. Uh-huh. And everything I have, I own. That's, That's how right. I'm looking at it. Because yeah. God can bless me with the look of you. Right. And I'm getting older. You're 27. Whatever. I ain't 27. I ain't been 27 in quite some time. It's not that it's bothering me anymore. I mean, I'm still getting roles and stuff. I just read to play the garbage can next trip. I thought I would have been done like six, seven years ago, for real. I thought I would have been like hit, hit. My shit was like raw. You remember my shit was like raw? Mm-hmm. I thought my shit was just like, mm-hmm. and then I'm telling you, that little punk ass force is trying to slow me down because I wouldn't do what you wanted me to do and you know what I'm talking about. Put that on YouTube. <laughs> He said Bluetooth. Yeah, but <laughs> <laughs> Bluetooth, that's the porno job. <laughs>